Hey guys, Matt here. Um, this is going to be a little video on liberty versus values. Now this is a video I've been meaning to make for a while, just never got around to doing it. wanted to go ahead and put it out there. Hopefully I'll get some good comments and video responses off this. Um, might even be a little controversial. Hopefully I won't piss anybody off. But um, Before I get into the versus part of this, I want to talk about kind of the meaning, what I'm talking about when I say liberty versus values. Liberty, first and foremost, is I, I think the best word we can use to describe the founding of our country, um, what the intention was. Um, liberty very much is that ability to have freedom to seek out your own happiness and your own way in the world. Okay, That is what liberty is. I mean, it's, it's, it's the root word for liberation, for being liberated. Um, it, it encompasses freedom in all its forms. Okay, uh, Freedom against tyranny. Uh, that, that is what liberty is. That's what we're talking about here. Now, values, on the other hand, are, are a set of things that we judge ourselves by, that we adhere to and try to live by, and things we hold dear and important to us. Now, when I talk about liberty versus values, it's a very important topic because, uh, now I notice it more here uh, in kind of the more right-leaning uh, side of things here on YouTube because we are in the gun community. There are a lot more people leaning right than left, obviously, but this is not something uh, simply beholden to the right. Uh, the left does this just as much as the right does. And this is where we try to impose our values on others, um, regardless of what these values may be. Now, keep in mind that there are no two people in this world that have the exact same set of values, period. There are none. But there are people in this world who generally have somewhat similar values, traditional type values, and they tend to stick together. Um, People do it on the right, people do it on the left. This is why we have Republicans and Democrats. Right-wing, you know, conservatives and, and left-wing liberals. I mean, this is, this is where this comes from. People grouping together who have similar sets of values. Or at least similar enough that they feel like they, be, they can become part of a group. But make no mistake, no two people in this world have the exact same set of values on everything. Now, the reason this comes into play, the reason why I want to make a video on it is because Trying to impose our values on others, much the way that the left and right does through the use of government uh, to try and do, um, is directly contrary to the Constitution, to the founding of this country. It's directly contrary to liberty. Okay? We need to understand that regardless of what we truly personally believe, and for the record, me personally, I am much more personally conservative, I lean more right you know, uh, I don't talk about it much, but God, guns, and country. Uh, at least I don't talk about the God part. But these are, these are values that I grew up with. This is stuff that I, uh, it's important to me. And, and that's just how I am. But I don't try to say that I have the right to impose my values on other people. Just because I hold something dear and close to me and I feel it's a personal value to me, doesn't mean that I think everyone should have the same values. Yeah, it'd be great in a perfect world if everyone had the same values, but it's not going to happen. And I don't have the right to impose on other people's liberty and freedoms by trying to impose my values on them. And that's what I want to get to, guys. Because, again, I notice it more on the right side of things, but that's because I, I associate myself more with the right side of things, and I spend more time talking to people on the right. But make no mistake, I have friends on the left, and I see the same kinds of things. I mean, examples of, of this are, are the three big ones, I think, that separate uh, right and left, you know, conservative and liberal, are going to be marijuana, uh, same-sex marriage, and abortion. Those are the three big ones, right? The three big ones that, that the right tries to impose their values on everyone, and the left tries to impose their values on everyone. Um, you know, I personally couldn't give a crap about weed, don't care, I don't do it, I don't care if anybody does. Um, same-sex marriage, again, I don't care, it doesn't affect me at all. Why should I be trying to impose my values on other people? Okay, uh, it doesn't affect me. I think the government should stay out of it. Marriage is a union under God, started by religion. That's where it should stay. All right, government shouldn't be involved in it. Abortion, I fall differently on. I'm very much anti-abortion, um, but I think the government should stay out of it. it. Should not be the government's decision what a person does or does not do with their own body. But I am, I am very much against abortion, um, except under extreme circumstances. But Again, it boils down to trying to impose our values on other people and the fact that it is directly contrary to liberty. And that's kind of the stuff I want to put out there, guys. Um, 
hopefully, again, I'm not trying to piss off any, any one group, right or left. Both sides do it. But if we want to move forward in this country, and if we want to do things like, you know, a lot of people talk about libertarian candidates and trying to, trying to be more free and open and, and, and stick more to the Constitution and all these kinds of things. In doing so, we are allowing maximum liberty in spite of values. And we need to understand that. Okay, it, you, you cannot be for the Constitution and for maximum liberty and at the same time want to impose your values on other people. It just doesn't work. That's not, that's not what liberty is. Okay, so anyway, that's it, guys. Um, hope you enjoyed it again. I look forward to some interesting comments and uh, video responses, hopefully. So appreciate you guys watching, and we'll talk to you later. Thanks.